Hey guys, you're watching Boondocking with Dennis. The sign for the Port Aransas Ferry today said wait time 15 minutes. And that is usually pretty accurate. Uh, from when I pulled up in line and parked till I got to the other side, one hour and two minutes. And the reason is there were a lot of tugboats coming back and forth, which delayed the ferry boats coming. It was kind of one thing right after another. But the reason there's so many tugboats coming by the ferry area, there's the pilot ship. They just ran a pilot out to a ship that's coming in. And I know I just said this a couple weeks ago. Look at a little puppy dog. This will be the biggest ship that I've seen come through the channel. I'm sure bigger ones have come through, but this is the biggest one I've seen. Uh, the one a few weeks ago was 336 meters long. There's a Eugene. Good morning, Eugene. A great blue heron. The one coming in right now is 339 meters long by 60 meters wide. It's going to be a uh, crude oil tanker and it's going to be flying the flag of Malta. Sorry, I had a little, little focus issue there. <laughs> And when they are done building, if they are ever done building the new Harbor Bridge and take down the old Harbor Bridge, I'm really looking forward to seeing the size of the ships that'll come in. These ones, uh, if you're not familiar with the area, there's a bridge that crosses the entrance to the Corpus Christi chip channel. And these big boys just make it under it. I mean, they're, <laughs> they must be cutting it close within a, within a few feet of the top. Sometimes it's, it's hard to tell by the, uh, by the angles, you know? But I'm looking forward to seeing this one. This one was built in 2022. And there's not even a photo of it um, on uh, Vessel Finder yet. So I could probably do a screen capture and get my photo up on uh, Vessel Finder. And there she is. It's a little, uh, I don't even want to say overcast, hazy today. Temperature is 65 degrees, late January 2024. It says the wind is two miles an hour. And while we're waiting, while we are waiting, you ready? Have you heard about the restaurant on the moon? Great food, no atmosphere. <laughs> the dad joke button. I'm going to try to uh, do a big loop from Rockport through Mustang Island, which we're on now, down to uh, Padre Island, Corpus Christi and then come back over 
the old harbor bridge that we were just talking about. But it's another gorgeous day in Port Aransas. There's another tugboat right there. You can just see the top of it. Getting ready to uh, help escort this massive ship uh, as you come inward bound from the Gulf of Mexico, like this one is. Maybe about three quarters of a mile ahead, there's a sharp left hand turn in the channel and that's where the tugboats earn their keep from what i understand a day like this with very little wind makes it a whole lot easier on the on the ships let's work for the men and women on the tugboats It's a uh, absolutely gorgeous day, guys. It's a weekday, so we didn't we don't have the crowds that uh, were here when the shell whale rig came through and was going out to sea. My friend Ethan was working on that rig when it was uh, dry docked here, and he said he was amazed at how clean it was came in like spotless and they did their work and when they left they had to make sure uh, the rig was spotless 339 meters by 60 meters so pretty impressive good morning the sea duchess it's a big one kids it's a big one She was going about six knots out in the open water. I would imagine she uh, slowed down a little bit when she got to here. Coming through the ship channel. And they'll slow down even more when they get to the bend. Oh, we got someone here out. Are they metal detected? All the winter Texans are down. I don't know. She might just be looking for stuff. These people got the right idea. Up in the front row. Good morning. There's some flags up here. Let's go look at their flags. And let's watch out for loose sand today. What do you think, kids? I can't make them out. I don't have my glasses on. That's pretty frightening. <laughs> I can't read your flag. I wanted to get my uh, phone out of the sun there for a little bit. Even on a cool day like this, I've had my phone shut off when it was just out in the uh, direct sun. So you can see the beaches. I don't know, it's even crowded today, but not like it was uh, on Sunday. It was uh, just super packed. We'll go down here and get a shot, see if we can uh, see the bow of the ship. And there's an open spot up there. See if we can catch any dolphins in the front that would be sweet you know what i'm going to go right here to this low spot there she comes What do we see, kids? Let me know if you spot a dolphin. 
Raise your hand if you, if you spot a dolphin. I can see them, uh, I saw two. They weren't jumping, they were just right there, like kind of just riding the front, you know? Well, that's interesting. Even the dolphins are mellow. <laughs> The Sea Duchess. So that's that just got painted two years ago. I'll give you an idea what the sea can do uh, can do to one of these ships. It's got a little hum to it. Sometimes they don't make any noise at all. This one's got a sweet little sound to it. Here comes the tug. Well, that's nice. Guys, it is a gorgeous day here in Port Aransas. It's a, it's a traffic jam. <laughs> Let's go see what else we can find on the island. Thanks for riding along today, guys. Thanks for watching.